Now for the latest on the international drama involving Edward Snowden, the U.S. government contractor who leaked American phone and data surveillance. Russia says he's still camped out at the Moscow airport in a hotel at the terminal seeking asylum for more than a dozen countries. Speculation mounted Tuesday that Snowden had flown out of Russia with Bolivia's president who was visiting for a summit. Bolivia denied the rumor and accused the U.S. of ordering European countries to block President Morales' flight from their airspace. And now there's angry finger pointing across Europe and Latin America. Meanwhile, Ecuador's Foreign Minister Ricardo Patino says a bugging device has been found inside his country's London embassy. That is where WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange is in hiding. Patino said the microphone was discovered two weeks ago when he was visiting the UK to meet Assange. CCTV's Richard Bestick reports from London. This latest twist has worsened an already tense diplomatic standoff here at the Ecuadorian embassy. Ecuador's ambassador provided only sketchy details about the hidden microphone discovered in her office. Maybe are you using that area to hear something from that? I don't know. Are you concerned about security now? Um, not really. Well, let's see how the things happen. Although the timing of the discovery suggests a possible connection to secret document leaker Edward Snowden's search for a political asylum, it could be related to the embassy's most notorious resident, WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange. Ecuador's foreign minister, Ricardo Petino, says the embassy found the bugging device two weeks ago when he was here marking the one-year anniversary of Assange taking refuge in the London embassy. The WikiLeaks founder is holed up here fighting extradition to Sweden on sex assault charges, which he denies. Assange has been trying to orchestrate safe passage for Snowden to Ecuador. That could still happen. Back in Ecuador's capital, Patino denied media reports that Ecuador had ruled out granting Snowden sanctuary. El, el gobierno... The Ecuadorian government wishes to deny certain claims and say that the stance of the government since the first day has been that we are ready to analyze the asylum request of Mr. Snowden. The alleged finding of a bugging device in the ambassador's office is not just an embarrassment for the British government. In the current climate, it is a diplomatic disaster on a pan-European scale. Richard Bestick, CCTV at the Ecuadorian Embassy in London.